to match fishing in Spain. My name's Ian Brown. Uh, you join me this morning. I'm at El Bosque. Um, been coming here uh, week in, week out, all during the lockdown. Not uh, filmed for a long while, so decided today to film the match. Uh, Nick's looking at me like I've gone mad on the next peg, but I'm actually talking to the camera. Uh, I've drawn peg 40, which is one of the best pegs on the place, to be honest. I would normally be very, very happy with peg 40, but Fortunately, I don't know if you can get it on the camera. All along the far bank where it normally has reeds, they've skinned it, completely skinned it up to three pegs. He's had the strimmer out. There's not a reed inside, so it's absolutely barren. But you have got this big corner here. Uh, it's flat calm at the moment. And whatever scum there is has gone in this corner, which is not always a good sign either. Uh, you want a bit of wind. Uh, and you want this scum gone because uh, they sort of tend to lie under the scum but you sort of can't catch them so uh, we'll give it our best go uh, and we'll see how we do Well, we're an hour in and it's not gone to plan at all, really. Uh, all about is three of them. Uh, there are fish over there, but I'm convinced they're just mullet. Just mithered to death with mullet. Uh, keep feeding, keep feeding the pellets and hopefully the cart will move in, hopefully. seen a carp. I think Nick's next door's had one small carp. We're just mithered to death with mully. And unless I put a maggot on, I can't get a bite. So I keep feeding pellets in the hope that I'll get some carp. But it's not looking likely at the moment. Thank <laughs> you. 
throw it up in the water, thinking that you get out there, and I wish a slightly better mummy, but that's about it. Fishing about a foot deep. And a four milli pallet. Slightly better carp, still not good enough. That's uh, better fish, sorry, not seen a carp. Still up in the water, it's a much bigger fish, but I tend to think this is a mullet still. But a bigger mullet. here.
something fail out. That is a definite. No more fish, fish for the feeder. Uh, fed the pace line, had a little go on it, nothing. Kept pinging across, seeing a few fish going across, I've just had a mulling. But I think that's all there is across there. I don't think there's anything else. Exactly the same result. I love it. Oh, it's not good.
Well, it's been a terrible day, really. Uh, I've struggled all day, I've been minded to death for it. I've wrapped my pole up because the wind's got up too much. I've had nothing over the upset mugger and I've thrown down the side. And I've now had three carp. Decent carp. No one they've been there all day, they always don't know them carp, but they would not touch bread. Normally you'd get a couple of of bread. Not touching, no idea why. Uh, tried sinking bread, tried on the bottom, tried half depth, tried everything. It's not been a good day by all accounts, but they have not done well. I understand they've got to cut reeds, but they've cut that to absolutely nothing. There's not a reed across there, so you've nothing to hold any fish, and the mullet are just cruising up and down looking for any bits of food they can get. Uh, so I've not had a carp across there, would normally you would catch carp. Not had them on the bottom across there. As soon as I'm throwing this in now, they're on it straight away. Uh, just little touches. I've been mixing some stuff up because we're off uh, on another match tomorrow. Uh, I've been mixing some red bait for that and I started using that. And, uh, they're on it, but there's only half an hour to go, so I'm not going to break any pots in this match. But there you go, you can't win them all.
well, there's about 10 minutes to go. Uh, I've had four count now on the feeder. Uh, perhaps I should have stuck on it all day. Uh, rather than messing about trying to get them over the wall. Uh, it's been a funny old day. Uh, I had no confidence when I first came here. Uh, mainly because that far bank and it's proved that way. It's full of mullet for some reason. Uh, should have stuck on the feeder really, or oh, fish long down there on the pole. But you're talking it's like 16 metres to that corner. So it's, it's a bit of a struggle really, so should have fished it on the tip really, and just persevered. But uh, you live and learn. Um, so, not doing anything in the match. Uh, but we've had a good day out, temperature's been very warm. Still very, very warm, it's probably, I don't know, 28, 29 degrees. Uh, even though it's cloudy, uh, but it's been a nice breeze, uh, and I think further up there, there's probably going to be some good waves. Oh, and I've missed one now, though. Uh, they're definitely in there now. Using this stodgy stuff that I mixed up for tomorrow. Uh, don't really intend fishing the feeder. Uh, you live and learn. for one more cast. 